Yo, yeah, what's up guys, and welcome back to another tutorial. I've had to record this video twice now because my microphone wasn't working the first time. Mm, I'm also getting a new PC, which is going to be litty titty, and I'm going to be able to upload videos a lot more. So, well, uh, I need to open my door. Hold on. E. There. Alright, so I'm going to teach you how to get rid of the black bars in a 4x3 resolution on CSGO, and if you don't know what a 4x3 resolution is, well, you have absolutely, like, no brain cells. So, uh, you're going to want to do what you just saw me did. You're going to right-click on the, uh, right-click on the desktop, and you're going to want to hit Intel Graphics Settings, and it's going to pull up this thingy. You're going to see the Asian dude with the red headset, and you're going to see the Tropico 5, and you're going to see World of Warcraft. <laughs> Oh, he's left-handed, by the way, because he's Asian. But you're going to want to click display. And whatever 4x3 resolution you're using on CSGO that you want to, like, get to widescreen, uh, you're going to want to type it in here. And if you don't know what height and width are, then you're pretty stupid. But, um, no, I'm just kidding. But say you're running at 640 by 480 640 goes in the top one, 480 goes in the bottom one, and then type in 60 in the last one. So uh, the refresh rate is supposed to be 60 unless you have a higher hertz monitor than 60. Um, then you can change it up. But if you go to your general settings, you're going to be able to see refresh right here. Never put it to 60i because that just kills you. Um, but yeah, then you're going to add that custom resolution. Go to your general settings here. And you go in here and you change this to the custom resolution that you just made. Uh, I'm not going to do it for the purposes of OBS and uh, them not knowing how to make it so that it automatically adjusts to your screen. But that's okay. Then you're going to go to uh, scaling. Or I don't think that's how you spell scaling. I honestly don't think. That, okay. Maybe I'm just retarded. But... You're going to want to click on scale full screen right here. And you're going to want to check override application settings. This will make it so that when you open the application that there's no black bars because it's scaling the full screen. Now, uh, this might not work on every single um, monitor, but this does work on mine. Now, enter CSGO. And once, you're, once you've entered CSGO, the black bars will be gone. Um, and you can come back in here and change it to 1920 by 1080, or you can change it to whatever, and you can change your refresh rate to, uh, 60i hertz, or just 60 hertz, um, I recommend 60 hertz, because 60 hertz is so much better than 60i, 60i is two sets of 30 fps running together to look like 60 hertz, but, Oh, wait, two sets of 30 FPS running together to look like 60 hertz. Yeah. Um, yeah. It's really bad. There's a lot of delay between... Okay, say I move my mouse right now. Here's when it would move. It's pretty bad. Um, so now that you're done with that, you can close out of here. And once you go back into CSGO, it should keep um, no black bars. And that's how you get rid of black bars on CSGO. And a 4x3 resolution. Also, if you're using 1280 by 800, uh, this will also get rid of the um, black bars on there as well. So that's how you get rid of black bars on CSGO and 4x3 resolution. Yeah, it's pretty, it's pretty neat.